Inside these bunkers near Pueblo, Colorado, some 780,000 shells filled with a toxic chemical that can maim or even kill. Now, this stockpile of mustard agent must be destroyed because of a treaty. Most of the government's stock of the agent has been wiped out by incineration, but not 2,600 tons in Colorado and Kentucky. The Army had done incineration at or had started incineration at other sites and had been very successful. But Kentucky and Colorado chose to push for a different route, and we've received all the financial support that we need. A plant in Pueblo will dismantle these shells, neutralize mustard in water, then add bacteria, producing a salt cake going to a hazardous waste dump. Local officials are going along with a disposal plan, but now there is more agent to destroy, and it may be incinerated instead of going through bioneutralization, concerning some in the community. The twist that has been thrown at us at the last minute that we had to make decisions on within a very short period of time, we do not know what will happen to the waste products from these technologies, and we were given about five days to make a decision. A dangerous agent headed for destruction, the Army says safely stored, but old, ready to be gone. Lee Powell, The Associated Press.